Welcome inside College Park Center. It is the 8-2 and two UT Arlington Mavericks taking on the 15-1 and one Texas State Bobcats. Welcome to Texas. I'm Josh Sowers. Let's take a look at what happened last night between these two teams. First of four meetings for these two squads. Bobcats, they have yet to lose a conference game. We saw them come out firing against UTA. Bobcats hitting 342 uh, hitting percentage last night. While the Mavericks offense, they struggled 158 as far as the hitting percentage goes. Two Bobcats finished in double-figure kills. Kennedy Rutherford, Julian Slaughter leading the way. Reigning setter of the year, Emily DeWalt, a double-double, 37 assists and 11 digs. Let's take a look at the players to watch for today's game. For Texas State, it is Janelle Fitzgerald. She put down eight kills in last night's match. She came into the weekend fourth in conference in hitting percentage and sixth in kills per set. Mansfield Legacy product, she's well on her way to another phenomenal season. Of course, there's a look at Fitzgerald right now. Her numbers expect a lot from her today. For the Mavericks, Junior Brooke Townsend. She continues to shine for the home team. She put down, she's put down double-figure kill numbers in eight of the ten matches this season, and she has three double-doubles this fall. Townsend last night, nine kills, a hitting percentage of 231, going along with four digs as well. So watch for Townsend, the catalyst of this UTA offense. Watch for her to get involved early for UT Arlington. Of course, we're getting a little later into this shortened season. You take a look at the conference standings over in the East Coastal Carolina. They are controlling things at 10-0. It's a battle of first and second place today. Texas State 10-0, UTA 8-2. And it's a big one between these in-state rivals today. So here we go. Players are ready to go. Texas State, they will serve Emily DeWalt, reigning setter of the year. She will lead us off. Happy to be back, everybody. We're underway inside College Park Center, Texas State in UTA. Michaela Wright almost snuck one there on the Bobcats. Kappel set this up, and this one knocked out of bounds. It's a kill for the Mavericks, and UTA starts off 1-0. Texas State ranked 13th in the country. Of course, just a few conferences playing fall volleyball this year. Officially, conference volleyball, I should say. DeWalt will set it up. And there's Kennedy Rutherford, who had a great game last night for UTA, or for Texas State, I should say, 11 kills. DeWalt, the quarterback of this offense, and struck out of bounds, and the Mavericks will take advantage. And it is 2-0 UT Arlington here early in set number one. You'll take another look at it. Rutherford had just missed firing. Junior out of Houston, Texas. Transfer from UTSA. They'll go to the right side. Fitzgerald, we just spoke about her in the open. Cap and Devin Martinka for UT Arlington. The Stanwood, Washington native. Rutherford from the left side. It's tipped. Great dive by Townsend. DeWalt backwards to Fitzgerald, and inbounds just past Allie Wells, the libero for uh, UT Arlington. And the Bobcats on the board, 2-1. to one. Fitzgerald is putting it inside that back line. And here's Kayla Tello to serve for the Bobcats. Townsend getting in. Townsend kill number 128 on the year for UTA. That is a team lead. And Allie Wells will send it over. There's a look. There's the freshman Samara Payton with the attack for UTA. Lauren Teske and Martinka on the other side. And it's out of bounds. Mavericks asking for the tip. Not called. 3-2 at UT Arlington. Texas State 15-1 on the season, 10-0 in conference. They have not lost a road game. Played by Alyssa Durand for UTA. Samara Payton with the attack and Fitzgerald. Good dig by Kylie Cap. One of the most experienced Mavericks on this very young UTA team. Fitzgerald. Mavericks with some good defense here early in set one. Denied by Peyton. The Bobcats keep it alive. It's a battle right at the net. Fitzgerald off a deflection. 
Good, good rally for both of these squads. And we are tied 3-3 here in set one. They just found the middle there between Duran and Cap. Jillian Slaughter to serve. From the middle, Tyranny Scott. And denied at the net. And it's a point for the Bobcats. 4-3, Texas State. Get a look at the net cam there. Slaughter to serve, the San Antonio, Texas product. Devin Martinka clips the net, and it's going to work out for the Mavericks. It doesn't have to be pretty every time. 4-4. Four, four. Coming in to serve for the Mavericks, Molly Blank. Freshman setter out of Mansfield, Texas. She's appeared in every game. She's made one start this season. Tierney Scott from the middle, denied by a pair of Mavericks. Brianna Ford was there, and they're going to get the point. 5-4, and a lot of energy shown so far for these Mavericks. Of course, Texas State winning last night here in College Park Center, three sets to zero. DeWalt, she's going to get Teske involved in the offense now. As Teske notches her 112th kill on the season. Back to serve for Texas State, Brooke Johnson. Tomball, Texas native. She is dangerous. Fifth in the conference in aces. And she will see has. Rolled it over Duran. Punched over by Peyton. And Teske off a deflection. And the point for the Bobcats as they regain the lead. Teske playing in her 15th game. Making her 14th start on the season. She had seven kills, 11 digs last night against the Mavericks. Townsend from the right side and just fanned on it out of bounds. Oh, and they're going to give a point to the Mavericks. Violation called on the Bobcats. We're knotted at six. Townsend will serve. Mass drop Texas is own. Right side attack, Tyranny Scott leads the Bobcats in hitting percentage. Her first kill of the day. Teske. We're going to forward there on the attack for the Mavericks. Amarillo native. And this one hit out of bounds. Point for the Mavericks. Both teams with a pair of attacking errors here in set one. We're tied at seven. And here's Samara Payton out of Richland High School in North Richland Hills. Just north of Fort Worth. DeWalt will set it up to the right side and Tyranny Scott. That's what Texas State does at their best. Scott will rotate out. Jillian Slaughter will come in and back to serve for the Bobcats will be Kayla Granado. Junior Libero. Underneath the ball, Molly Blank. First attack of the game by Brianna Brown. Denied at the net by Wright. And Rutherford, who had 11 kills last night, she'll add another one here today. Nine, seven. Mavericks led 2-0, but it's been close ever since. It's the largest Bobcat lead here early in set one. Blank, backwards. That was Brianna Ford. And the Bobcats somehow keep it alive, but it's out of bounds. And the Mavericks will get the point. Rotations for both squads. Kylie Cap and Devin Martinka come in for UTA. And there's a look at Cap. Currently second in the conference coming into this weekend in aces per set. 
Soft toss over this time. Rutherford denied by Martinka. Devin Martinka all by herself. Her second solo block of the year, 24 now in the fall. We're nine all. Cap, just that slight tap. Rutherford, and that stays inbounds. Point for the Bobcats. This is some good volleyball here in set one. And here's Emily DeWalt serving. Back to back setter of the weeks in the Sun Belt Awards. And unable to be saved, it went off Granado and DeWalt couldn't quite get to it. Momentum was carrying her the other way and we're tied again, 10-10. Alyssa Duran comes in for a UT Arlington to serve. She's got 12 aces on the year. Rutherford, they're giving her the ball early. Michaela Wright keeps it in bounds. Right, second kill today, 49 now on the year, the junior, the 6'5 junior, dual sport athlete here at UTA, also plays Lady Mavs basketball. They'll get those seasons started here in a couple weeks. Battle at the net, dumped over by Slaughter, cap backwards, softly tipped over by Townsend, off the net, back on the Mavericks side, battle between Wright, and it's won by the Mavericks. Wright and Slaughter tangling there. And Michaela Wright, who has played in all 39 sets for the Mavericks here in 2020. 12-10 UTA. Fitzgerald is denied by Townsend, but the ball falls outside the pink line. Tello serves for Texas State. Right, got a hand on it. Granado underneath it. Fitzgerald goes off the shoulder of Wright. It's going to be out of bounds. And a point for the Bobcats. We're knotted at 12. Back in fourth action here in set one. Texas State first in the West. UTA second place in the West. Duran. And now Martinka. DeWalt and Fitzgerald right down the middle. Fitzgerald with a game high five kills. And it's 13-12 Texas State. Served by Tello. Michaela Wright finds the open space. And Michaela right now with four kills in the match. Four kills, six total attacks for the junior. Allie Wells back in the game. She will serve it for the Mavericks. And Fitzgerald with the attack. He goes off Townsend's left hand, and it'll drop. Julian Slaughter to serve. Very fast pace, set one. Cap, Townsend off a deflection. Tello was underneath it. Oh, a hammer attack. Lauren Teske. Timeout on the floor. It's a good one so far in set one. Texas State 15, Mavericks 13. This is good Sunbelt Conference volleyball. Two-point lead here in set one for Texas State. Jillian Slaughter, she'll send it over. Martinka, dive by DeWalt to save it. And Teske beyond the three-meter line. And Samara Payton, a little too early on the swing. And the largest lead of the game for any team at 16-13, Texas State. Duran off the serve. Peyton will get another try, and this one hit out of bounds. Fielded by 
Sean Hewitt, head coach of Texas State in his first season as the head coach. And we're going to get a timeout on the floor. So timeout called by JT Winger. Both teams done with their huddles. Mavericks in their blue uniforms today. Texas State in their all black uniforms. Except the Liberos, of course. It's a 4 0 run for the Bobcats. 17 13 here in set one. As Julian Slaughter, the junior, hits it over. Peyton denied. She gets another try at it. DeWalt, Tyranny, Scott out of bounds. Point for the Mavericks, and that'll stop the 4-0 run for the Bobcats. In to serve for the Mavericks, Molly Blank. One of the six freshmen on this UTA team. Blank sends it over to the right side. DeWalt had to go after it. Whistle blown. I'm going to get a violation called. It's going to be a Texas State point. Sub for Sean Hewitt's squad. Brooke Johnson comes in. Fierce attack. Brianna Ford. She's already made a name for herself. She was the week seven Sunbelt Conference freshman of the week. Currently in the top 10 in kills on the year among conference players. That was a big one there for Ford, her second of the day. 18-15 as the Mavericks try to come back here in set one. Tyranny Scott. Wells chases after it in the corner. And Ford gets it over. DeWalt with the dump over. We saw that a few times last night. And it's 19-15. Emily DeWalt, her 53rd kill of the year. Of course, DeWalt, the setter, came into the weekend fifth in the country in assists per set. Playable for Johnson, and Rutherford will try from the left side of the floor. Ford just missed it wide right out of bounds, and it's a five-point lead for Texas State in set one. Teske, and before that, we have a timeout on the floor as JT Winger will utilize his second timeout. Take a look at today's starting lineups presented by Texas Trust Credit Union, the official credit union of UTA Athletics. Get your UTA-branded debit and credit cards only at Texas Trust Credit Union. Of course, Texas State, no big changes from yesterday. We've already seen some numbers put down by Fitzgerald and DeWalt. Teske getting in on the offense as well. For the home team Mavericks, Devin Martinka getting her sixth start of the season, along with Samara Payton. Allie Wells, see her there? It's her first official start of the year. She's played in every match. Brianna Brown, Michaela Wright, Kylie Cap, Brooke Townsend. We'll round it all out for UT Arlington. Townsend starting every match so far this season for UTA. She has also played in all currently 39 sets for the Mavericks. Bobcats out of their huddle. Mavericks will return to the floor. Bobcats 20, Mavericks 15. Second of four total meetings this season for these two teams. Of course, with the scheduling this year, the in-state rivals are what typically would be your travel partner in a normal year. Playing it four times, and here's a service error by Teske. Of course, Texas State ranked 13th in the country. If there is one thing you take away from Texas State, I'm sure Sean Hewitt would like to improve on it, is their serving. It's their 110th service error on the season. Blank underneath it, and it's going to be Brianna Ford. DeWalt sent it over. And that one hit over Brianna Brown, freshman out of White House, Texas. 
Brown, her second kill here in this first set. And the Mavericks have the lead down to three as Samara Payton will serve it. Tierney Scott and misplayed by the Mavericks. Point for the Bobcats. 21-17, Texas State. Serious history between these two teams. It's a dead heat right now. 43 wins, 43 losses. Mavericks 19 and 19 all time against Texas State here in College Park Center. And look at that velocity put down by the Mavericks as they fight back. Well, Brianna Ford annihilating the volleyball. Kylie Kapp will serve. DeWalt as Slaughter had to wait on it. Townsend, Cap gets underneath it with her left arm. And up the middle, nothing Cap can do there as Slaughter. Not just her first kill of the day. Emily DeWalt will serve. And here's Martinka from the right side. Denied and still saved, but it's going to be out of bounds and a point for Texas State. 23-18. DeWalt. Martinka. Good dig by Kayla Granado. And Janelle Fitzgerald finds the open space. A little trickery there from Fitzgerald. And a game high seven kills on now 13 total attacks for Janelle Fitzgerald hitting above 500. And it's set point for Texas State. And they've got some room. Hit over by right, backwards. Teske chases after it. And Martinka, she finds the space. Devin Martinka. Two kills for Martinka. Had three kills last night against the Bobcats. Still set point for Texas State, but the Mavericks aren't going to go away quietly. And here's Alyssa Duran from El Paso, Texas. 12 aces on the year. It's Gerald. It goes off Duran, and it's going to be saved by Wells. Can Townsend get to it? She cannot, and Texas State will claim a very entertaining set one, 25-19, and they take a 1-0 lead here inside. The percentage goes. Janelle Fitzgerald led the way with Texas State, eight kills. Is Michaela Wright for the Mavericks, four kills apiece. Emily DeWalt already 17 assists for uh, Texas State. Ranks her number five in Texas State program history. And she chases that no, number one spot. Some moves there from Brown to Brown and Samara Payton. Mavericks control the serve here to start set two. It'll be Kylie Cap. Cap six assists, three digs in set one. She'll start us off here in set two. Bobcats up 1-0. Slaughter attacking from the middle. There's Allie Wells and Martinka. And Martinka gets it down right in front of Brooke Johnson. And Devin Martinka, her third kill in this match today in Arlington. Now it's just like they did in set one, take a 1-0 lead. Cap across the line. Rutherford. And Brianna Brown from the left side. Could be trouble here. Granado has to clear out her bench to go after it. Brooke Johnson will save it and get it over. Martinka. Granado. And Rutherford saves it. Keeps it between the antennas. This one's off Teske and into the front row. 2-0 lead UT Arlington. What an attack there from Brianna Brown, the freshman, who also has garnered a Sunbelt Conference Freshman of the Week award this year. Rutherford off a deflection, saved by Wells, seemingly out of nowhere. Cap will get it over. 
And Johnson, bit of a struggle for DeWalt to get over Johnson. This ball then hits the antenna by Rutherford, and the Mavericks have a 3-0 lead to start set two. Allie Wells chasing that ball down, and that ball goes off the antenna. Cap clips the net. That's the first service error of the match for uh, UTA. Just their 48th of the season. Mavericks come in with the second best service aces per set number in the conference. And Michaela Wright can't save it after it went off the net. And the Bobcats, they claim the last two. Emily DeWalt back to serve. 16th start of the season for DeWalt. Wells underneath it. And trickery from Cap. It is Halloween after all, trick or treat. It's a trick and a treat for the Mavericks, 4-2. We do have at least one person inside College Park Center with a costume on. Melissa Duran will serve it. And Devin Martinka. She was already thinking about the end result. Just fanned on it. It's 4-3 now, UTA. Michelle Foster will send it over for the Bobcats. Michaela Wright out of bounds, barely. That was good awareness from Tello to let that ball go. 4-4. Wells chases after the serve. It's Townsend denied at the net by Slaughter. Fitzgerald was over there as well. And the Bobcats now take a 5-4 lead. UTA led 3-0 to start the second set. Now the Bobcats take control. Here's Michelle Foster serving again. Bit of a homecoming for her. She's from Allen, Texas, just north of Dallas. DeWalt and Slaughter. You couldn't have timed that perfect. Sean Hewitt knew it, too. He came immediately off the bench. It's a hard ball to defend, and we're going to get a timeout called by J.T. Winger. Bobcats, they're up 6-4 in this second set. UT Arlington trying to... Bobcats six, Mavericks four, back here in set number two here in Arlington, Texas, as Kayla Tello continues to control the serves for Texas State. Bobcats on a 4-0 run. DeWalt, Fitzgerald, and out of bounds. Point for the Mavericks as Fitzgerald, her first attacking error of the game. Otherwise, it's been sensational for Fitzgerald. Eight kills, now 14 attacks, still hitting above 500. She's added three blocks as well. Allie Wells put some air on it. Out of bounds, service error for UTA, 7-5, Texas State. Jillian Slaughter. And we'll trade service errors. 7-6 Bobcats as Molly Blank will come in for a UTA to serve. Martinka and Cap sub out. Teske. Oh, what a save by Duran. And Ford. That could be a huge momentum swing for the Mavericks. A great save by Alyssa Duran. Big time attack by Brianna Ford. We're knotted at seven. DeWalt. Teske again. Allie Wells plays it. And Brooke Townsend keeps it in bounds. Going for that left corner. Mavericks regain the lead 8 7 as they're trying to go on a run of their own. They've scored the last three. Tyranny Scott.
Scott's fourth kill. So we're knotted back up at eight. And here's Brooke Johnson. And trouble with it. After Ford got to it, it was at the net. And Texas State took advantage. Ford off her shoulder. Tierney Scott was there to defend the front line. The Bobcats make it 10 to 8. So now, we're just trading 3 0 runs for both teams. So Brooke Johnson will continue to serve. Miscommunication. Wells got underneath it. Duran had to react late. It doesn't make JT Winger happy. And with that, he will call a timeout. 21. Brooke Johnson. And they're going to let Brianna Ford attack from the middle, and a whistle is blown. It's going to be a Texas State point. Looks like one of the Mavericks slipped over the line. 5 0 run for Texas State. Blank. Townsend. Teske tipped it over. Now it's a battle at the net. Peyton was over there for UTA. Granado finds it. Teske from the pink three-meter line. Peyton, good dig from Johnson. Teske will try it. Denied. Bobcats reset. Teske, and it goes off Wells. It's 13-8. Texas State, who now on a 6-0 run. Helmed by Brooke Johnson. And we're going to get a timeout called. Well, you think they've worked on this before. That's impressive. You can dance when you're 10-0 in conference. Ranked number 13 in the country. We even saw some of the Texas State coaches getting in on the dance routine in the warm-ups. Officials are still talking it over at the scores table. And they have awarded the point to Texas State. 13-8. And here's Brooke Johnson back to serve who's been in control, helming the 6-0 run. Ford denied. Wells got back to it. And Townsend from the right side this time, and she will stop the run. Point for the Mavericks. For Townsend, her fourth kill in this afternoon matchup. Melissa Duran subs out. Brianna Brown in. Townsend coming into the match, 620 career kills as a UTA Maverick. And Tyranny Scott from the right side keeps it inbounds past the Mavericks. 14-9, Texas State. Teske to serve. Former team captain at Samuel Clemens High School. Her brother, her brother Logan, currently a pitcher at Southeastern Oklahoma. Whistle blown, and we have our games at first. Double touch, and it's called on the home team. Some unforced errors by the Mavericks. It's a 15-9 lead for Texas State. There's Brown from the left side. Rutherford. Blank chases after it. Brown will try again. Granado. Digs it up. Wells, and it goes back on the Texas State side. Almost hit the Jumbotron, and it's a Texas State point, Tyranny Scott. Seven kills for Scott. Teske will serve. 16 to nine. The Bobcats back on a 3-0 run. 
DeWalt will set it up. Scott pushes it over. Payton right at the net. Brown can't keep it between the antennas. That's a tough play for the freshman, Brianna Brown. It's 17-9. Bobcats here in set number two. Texas State leads 1-0 in the match. Second of four total meetings this year for the two teams. Mavericks and Texas State, they will conclude the 2020 regular season, November 13th and 14th in San Marcos. And here's a big kill for the Mavericks. Blank set it up. Brianna Ford put it on the tee box. She drove it down the fairway. DeWalt, it's her second time she's done that. And it typically works out for her. DeWalt, the preseason setter of the year. She's the back-to-back -back Sunbelt Conference setter of the year. Among a whole bunch of awards. Brown denied at the net by Slaughter and DeWalt. She'll try it again. This time gets it over and off Teske. That's a point for the Mavericks. Sub here for the Mavericks. Two subs. Cap and Martinka roll in. Here's Kylie Cap back to serve for UTA. He's got seven assists and four digs. Cap, the Wiley East High School product. Martinka, after it deflected off Michaela Wright, Wells, free play here for the Bobcats. Rutherford, and it goes off Martinka and out of bounds. Eight-point lead. DeWalt to serve. Martinka from the right, Slaughter and Fitzgerald with the, den the denial. Well, Janelle Fitzgerald, eight kills, making now four blocks for her. It was Texas State's sixth block of the game. Mavericks have one. Mavericks are giving the ball to Brianna Brown. And Rutherford, but thrown down by Brown. Five kills for Brianna Brown. She had four kills last night. She's now got a Maverick team high, pardon me, four kills for UTA. Brianna Ford with the team high five for the Mavericks. Wells from out of bounds and Martinka had to wait and that brief stutter Forced to change and not able to keep it in bounds. 21 12. Michelle Foster, an ace and eight digs last night. DeWalt sets it up. Slaughter, Jillian Slaughter. Three kills for her today. 22 to 12. And Texas State in control in this second set. Townsend, hook up by Granado. It's going to be a battle at the net. And Townsend, using her left hand this time, knocks it over out of the reach of Fitzgerald. 22 13. Here's Allie Wells. And that goes off. Wells just missed it. And Fitzgerald. Ten point lead. And Sean Hewitt is going to get a substitution here. Slaughter is going to come out back to serve. Will be Emily Smiley. Fresh middle blocker out of New Braunfels, Texas. This will be her fourth match she has appeared in. It's a dangerous serve. Samara Payton. Fitzgerald. Underneath it, point for UTA. Oh. 
Smiley subs out. For Sean Hewitt's squad. Molly Blank back to serve for the Mavericks. Freshman fires it over to Teske. Tierney Scott from the middle. That's tough to defend. Watch out, cardboard cutouts. And it's going to be set point Texas State. 24-14. It'll be Brooke Johnson to serve. Wells. Brianna Ford. Too much out of bounds. And Texas State will claim their second set victory. 2-0 for Texas State. 25-14 in set number two after winning set one at 25-19. Intermission time in Arlington. Set three coming up individually for the Bobcats with nine kills, hitting 438 right now. She has four. Ford will start it off for uh, UTA. Wells, blank. Courtney Puckett is into the game before UTA. Somehow Fitzgerald gets it back over. Oh, and then we're going to get a double touch call. Mavericks knew it immediately, and it's a point for the Mavericks to start set number three. Townsend will serve it for UTA. Fitzgerald. We'll play it. And Slaughter all by herself. Split the middle of Courtney Puckett and Brianna Ford. So Courtney Puckett, the freshman, into the game for the Mavericks out of Bentonville, Arkansas. Her eighth match she's played in. She had two kills, one block last night against the Bobcats. And here's Brianna Brown out of bounds. Past the line judge. Charles Wheeler. 2-1 Bobcats here in set number three. Texas State leads the match 2-0. Oh, big time attack. That ball deflected eight rows deep. And Brianna Ford notching her seventh kill of the season. She's got 96 on the year now. And here's Courtney Puckett. Townsend. And here's Ford from the left side this time. Granado underneath it. And Fitzgerald denied. And it goes off the shoulder of Townsend. And a point for Texas State. Good battle for these two teams. 3-2 Bobcats. Slaughter back to serve. Rihanna Brown. Tyranny Scott, we've seen it time and time again. Nine kills for Scott today. Tyranny Scott, or Scott, the six foot middle blocker. Senior out of Houston, Texas. She came into the weekend third in the conference in hitting percentage. And trouble at the net. Texas State with the point. And now it's 5-2 Bobcats. It's one thing the Mavericks cannot do in this third set is let Texas State get away with an early lead. Sometimes when they play their best. Fitzgerald denied by Brown. Point for the Mavericks. Just the third block of the game for UTA is Brianna Brown, her sixth solo block of the year. Three serves, five. And up the middle, Tyranny Scott again. Six three, Brooke Johnson in for the Bobcats to serve. Wells, it's back on Texas State's side and it's out of bounds. Teske tried to take advantage of it and it just crossed the line. Sean Hewitt 
He's he is asking his team, should he challenge, and he is. We're gonna get a try to get a look here. Sean Hewitt has the challenge card in his hand, talking to the official, and no. Oh, they are gonna review it. Okay. So we'll get a look at it here. Teske saw that ball heading her way and she knew what she had to do. It's gonna be a big decision here in set three. Of course, with the Mavericks trailing 2-0. See if we can get a look here. From my vantage point, it did look out of bounds the way the Mavericks reacted. And still. All right, here we go. Well, deflected off Wells, and that ball that looked like that actually snuck in. Everybody watching the video board right now. Texas State is in the Congo line. Well, they were. So the officials will keep taking a look. Maybe another look can, and that, you know, with the with the glare of the lights, it almost looks like it was out of bounds. And we're gonna get back to up here and see from this angle. Well, uh, here's the here's the decision right here. In bounds, point for Texas State. And I think that first angle we saw was the deciding point. So. That will make it a 7-3 lead for Texas State instead of a 6-4 lead. And UTA does not have the serve. So Brooke Johnson will send it over. We're back underway in set three. Brianna Brown, and it goes off Granado. She immediately regretted her decision going after it. And it's 7-4. Brianna Brown, the attack. She's now got six kills in the game. Scott. And Townsend. Johnson pops it straight up in the air. Teske from the line and a whistle. Point for Texas State. Teske to serve. Of course, Texas State, 15-1 and one on the year. Their only loss came back on September 12th, a home loss to UTEP. And Brooke Townsend gets it going. Townsend now six kills to go along with eight digs. It's a well-placed ball by Brooke. Allie Wells will send it over. Scott from the right side, and then just kind of falls off the shoulder of Brooke Townsend. Tierney Scott in double figures. She's got 11 kills now for Texas State. It's been a good weekend for her. And this one out of bounds. Third service error of the match for Texas State. And Molly Blank will go back to serve for UTA. Six will serve nine here in the third set. Blank finds the right side. And here's Caitlin Butner, who is into the game for Texas State. We did not see her play in those first two sets, and a denial by Slaughter and DeWalt. Slaughter, her third total block of the match. Bobcats lead 10-6, and here's Emily DeWalt. 
who has added 31 assists so far to her total. Bobcat point. They'll give a solo block to Janelle Fitzgerald. Makes it five total for her today. Big time attack by Ford, popped up in the air. Granado plays it, now Butner throws it over. And Brianna Ford. Big time attack, Fitzgerald. She is having quite the game. She's in double figures now, 10 kills for Janelle Fitzgerald. Timeout called, JT Winger. Here's a look at Janelle Fitzgerald, we talked about just the monster game she's had so far. 10 kills, five blocks, hitting above 350 in this match. Brianna Ford, and there's Fitzgerald again. Six blocks for Fitzgerald in this one. That at ties her career high, which she has done now five times in a match. DeWalt. Here's Puckett from the right side and out of bounds. Point for the Bobcats and the Mavericks. They've let the last five points slip away. It's a 14-6 lead. Here's Emily DeWalt. Townsend and Buechner with the block. Fifteen six. Forward up the middle, Granado. This is going to be back on the Mavericks side. Blank. Townsend. Does it clip the antenna? It does, as signaled by the line judges. 16-6. Mavericks got to get something. JT Winger is talking to the officials and his team, and he is not going to challenge us. We play on. Townsend. DeWalt played the deflection. Granado underneath it. Fitzgerald denied. Still playable for the Bobcats. Fitzgerald on the run. Off. Two Mavericks and out of bounds. Fitzgerald with now 11. Texas State hitting 316 in the game. Mavericks hitting 0-3-0. And there's a dump off by the Mavericks. Puckett then sent it over. Blank. Townsend from the right side this time. Fitzgerald doing it all right now for Texas State. Townsend. And out of bounds. Brooke Townsend will stop an 8-0 run. Seven kills for Townsend now. As that ball went off Granado, the libero. Townsend a deep breath. Here's the serve. Irish need to put together a streak here. Butner hit it. Denied. Fitzgerald from the right side. Good dig from Blank. Ford, a little too much on it, out of bounds. And Sean Hewitt is going to have a couple subs come in as Michelle Foster will go back to serve. And Courtney Heiser into the game out of the Woodlands, the sophomore outside here, just her sixth appearance of the year. 18-7, Texas State leads UT Arlington. Brown from the left. Puckett gave it a try. And Ford from the right side, and she will put it down. Point for the Mavericks. Puckett to serve. Four-time all-conference selection at Bentonville West High School and Texas State. Heiser with a little trouble. Mavericks will take advantage. 18-9, Bobcats. Slaughter out of bounds. 10 will serve 18. Pocket. 
DeWalt chases it down. And here's Heiser out of bounds. And the Mavericks. Sean Hewitt, uh, he's going to grab the challenge card. Looks like he says that ball may have been in bounds. So both teams will huddle up. If it stands, it's 11-18. That'll be the serve. See if I can get a look here. The attack by Heiser. That ball clearly out of bounds. If that is indeed what he is challenging. Did not challenge the spot. It is a UTA point. So nevertheless, we roll on. 11 will serve 18. Perhaps saying that ball was tipped, but nevertheless, it was not. Puck it back to serve. Heiser plays it. DeWalt will give it to Fitzgerald into the net. And the Mavericks kept it alive, but it's going to be a Texas State point. Started with that Heiser dig. It's now 19 will serve 11. A couple subs here for Sean Hewitt. Once again, Emily Smiley back in for Texas State. Kind of a serving specialist. Blank. Ford into the net. Fitzgerald will hit it over. Point for the Mavericks. Saw the setup from Blank and Brianna Brown. She's had a nice game today. Six kills now for Brown. Hitting just a shade under 300. Cali Cap will serve. Tierney Scott. Cap was ready for it. Devin Martinka, who's back into the game, who started today's match. Scott off a deflection, and that'll be out of bounds. Bobcats reach 20. And here's Brooke Johnson. Oh, and a misplay by Brown. It's an ace for Brooke Johnson. Second ace today for the Bobcats. And Brooke Johnson is responsible for both of those. Martinka. That's a great play from Martinka. Went to the other side, and there's not a whole lot you can do with that type of offense. Granado dove after it a little bit too late. And now Alyssa Duran will serve. Cats with a little trouble with it. DeWalt will set up Heiser. Cap right at the net. Michaela Wright will tap it over and gets the kill. Michaela Wright, who had a great set one. That's her fifth kill today. Fourteen will serve 21 here in set three. Emily DeWalt set it up. Heiser attacked. And now here's Martinka for UTA. DeWalt dumped it over. Here's Townsend. Just punched it forward. What a slide by Wells. And now right up the middle. It's deflected. This is a good rally here. Scott will end it. 13 kills for Tyranny Scott. She was, she was done with that volley. She didn't want no more of that. Kayla Tello back to serve. The Buda, Texas native. Wright again. Oh, Michaela Wright. Six kills now for the junior out of Columbia, Missouri. Twenty-two, fifteen, and here's Allie Wells to serve into her own net. And that's the third service error for uh, UT Arlington. 
That'll give the serve to Texas State, who needs two more points to get their 16th win of the year and their 13th in a row. Kayla Granado. Cap and Courtney Puckett. First kill of the game. Sixteen will serve twenty-three. Molly Blank. DeWalt. And that's Emily Smiley who sends it out of bounds. Point for UTA. At seventeen will serve twenty-three. Played by Tello. Butner, too much on it out of bounds. Trying to go across the other way. 18 will serve 23. So a couple errors by the Bobcats. And Molly Blank with the ace. First ace of the game for UTA. That's her 11th of the season. All of a sudden, this has turned into a four-point set three. Townsend off the net. It works. And don't look now. But UTA has made this a three-point set three. Now we're trying to ride some momentum here. Slaughter gets it down. It was a 5-0 run for UTA who are at one point down 20 to 12, but now it's gonna be set in match point for Texas State. Emily DeWalt will try to end it here for the Bobcats. Blank backwards, Townsend keeps it in bounds. It's 21-24 and the Mavericks aren't going away yet. Brooke Townsend, it's nine kills for her. She had nine kills last night. Can the Mavericks keep it going here? Oh, and she hits it into her own net. And Texas State will claim a three-set sweep against UT Arlington. Bobcats, 13 wins in a row. They improved to 16-1 on the season.